Hello, hello there, boys of light. How is Final Fantasy XIV treating you so far? Hope that you had a wonderful time with it. Fighting against the hardest challenges that came your way. The Crystal Tower raids, maybe? Then again, you can also take it easy, craft what you like, or some field exploring for some fishing materials. And most importantly, enjoying yourself with the base game. All leading up to the next step in your journey with the expansion, Heaven Sword, with an award winning story and expanded all the way up to level 60, where we can fight against some dragons in a Dragon Song War, helping out a new part of the continent in the world of Eorzea further from the north. So you know what that means. More fashion outfits for you to wear. This video is all about that. This is a series where I'll be showing some wonderful outfits for you all to wear. Outstanding mix sets to stand out, compared to every basic player that wears the same set like those NPCs around me. Where in this episode, we are going to have an amazing fashion that we can wear for the 13 jobs in the game that you can play in the first expansion, Heaven Swords. For the Sprout who just started out with their part of their journey, we are going to make fashion that you can wear all the way up to level 60 with only the use of the market board, NPCs and basic content that the PvE has in store. So no grand company of the base game, golden sources, PvP, seasonal rewards and the Mughal store. All those sets that we can wear are for you for the taking. Easy peasy right? It just takes some time if you are very unlucky. Also, before we go any further, a disclaimer. Everyone has their own taste what they like or dislike to wear. Because fashion is an open-minded thing and everyone has their own looks what they want to look for it. Will it be good or bad? All is okay in here since in the end of the day, it's about what you like to wear for your boy of light. See this more as a helping guide on some amazing fashion ideas that you can use. With it all said, shall we start about right now? Sprouts and Moogles, welcome all to Fashion Fantasy Heavensward's Edition. Let's begin with the job that had the biggest meltdown after what happened in the base game. From the realm reborn. The Sultana of Uda was poisoned before your eyes, and everyone blames you what you did. So even if they need to hide their faces, they are swearing to protect the people of Eorzea, even if it is against their own protection. The Mask of Valkyrie Helm of Finding is a one of a headpiece only to be obtained from a post credit dungeon that you must do if you want to do the story bits. Or you want to fight in the library that is from an old witch in hard mode. Don't worry, you won't miss her even back in the Final Fantasy 1 days. The rest, simple market items for you. And it's a very common one that most people like to wear. So give it your own color for it to stand out a little bit more. My recommendation. Let us shine with this fancy new set for the Noble Knights. Stylish and good looking for this new shiny armor. Still, you want to go out there and make a name for yourself, even if it can destroy your fancy new set. The issue with this fancy set has to be the body piece, Valkyrie Chorus of Finding. No, it's not a Dishonored dungeon, no no no. It's the same library dungeon that we talked about with Warrior. It's only that this is a one of a kind piece, like the previous one, only this piece more people like to roll for it. So even then, so I hope you roll high if you want to go for it. The gloves are from two dungeons, but I rather pick the other one that is hard mode since there are more unique pieces that you can get from this dungeon alone. Just be sure that you do the final boss right against the blue fireball up here. Leggings can be anything since the shoes are all the way to your legs with some nice plated Templar shoes. Nice little chains that fit well to the rest of this fancy set. Where the paladin is the light for the people, this new role is the total opposite. Protecting the people even if it is against the rules, without even their knowledge. So most people see them as the demon knight, so let's reflect on it. 
The main goal for this set is the Diabolic Mail of Finding. And its only way to defeat it is to defeat the Demon Lord itself wanted to destroy the world behind everyone's back while they were fighting against the dragons. So you, the Sky Pirates, and other people are doing it all in secret. So kind of fitting that you were the real Demon Lord part, so they think you are the Demon Lord. But we all know you do it for the better goods. For the horns, everyone can join in it, no matter what kind of grand company you have joined for the hunting seasons. Since this is a hunting cosmetic reward with exclusive Centrios heels for Heaven's Sword. Hence, say it with me, Battles of the Dead rewards or against the Bahamut in their raid. Then we have the leggings with feet. Hemkin Braves of Finding are master tier crafting, so be careful in the market board if you want to buy it. Rather that you make it yourself, then there are the feats that you can buy with the elegant tombstones of Poetic. Let's keep it up close everyone, even with the melee DPS that we are talking about now. Dragoon is the first up with the basic gear that is all the way up from the market. So you can beat the Dragoon main like in those trailers that we had for the first expansion. Just keep in mind that the Icon Letter Corslet of Maiming is the main corset for this idea that I have for you all. Better craft it for yourself or buy it from the market board with an heavy price. Even high up into the north, the monks have their mind and body all trained for it for this occasion. Sure, they need to wear a little bit more protection over there since the main enemies are against the dragons. Since, you know, they can spit fire against you from a distance. Yet the monk can still avoid it with ease since all they wear is almost up to nothing compared to all the close-up jobs that we have for today. No matter what challenge lies ahead of them, they sure know that even the true dragon can be put down with a hard punch against the nose. Just whatever you do, don't pick up their eye with your bare hands. I have heard that even a well-trained monk can easily be corrupted with one of those eyes. Let's bring a little bit more fantasy time around for it. Sure, blending in as a ninja is the main goal, but if you are against some dragons in their expansions, then what is the point in blending in? Yet one thing needs to stay for a ninja, and is to hide your face no matter what, pick up a simple scarf from the market board, or if you want to go fantasy and a little bit more effort into it, the Moogle tribe is there for you. For the pants, it's all up to you what you want to go for, yet for me, with the blue crystals that fitted well with the main body, I had to go to do an alliance raid with the Sky Pirates, the Weeping City of Mark, just to get those pants up, since it's the same blue crystals that we see here, like I said, with the main body. With every melee now in the front line fighting against the dragons, we do tend to forget they can fly up into the skies, unless you are a dragoon, and breed you with their fire. Good thing is, we can aim them from a distance with a bow and arrow with a bard. Always there for the party to play some songs during the hardest night when the party is unhappy to sleep from this horrible night against the dragons. So long if they can cheer people up whatever music they want to hear, they will be happy to provide. And I need to cheat a little bit on this one against my own rules. No, it's not the headpiece, that's the simple one that we get from the dungeon. It's about the hands what we have here. Adios Shoulder Gloves are kind of story related quest for the Bard if you want to get them for the first time. But if you want to get multiple copies of it, then we have to do it the same as what we did with the Dark Knight job. With Curious Seals from the hunting list. So you tell me, am I even allowed to make sets with parts of bodies that are from a job related quest? With a specific job? I would say yes. Only for the level 60 sets for now, since you can only get them if you use those curio seals to make them yourself. Even at war, how can the civilians protect themselves against the dragons? They don't have any skills when it comes to combat, let alone use a bow and arrow. So how do we solve this solution? We give them a gun, 
and some technology with our new job the mechanist clocking our way in in this expansion they sure know how to fire their gun in a short time of window so far only engineers know how to wield a gun with safety hence why i wanted to make a set that looks like an engineer already to test out his tech all crafted with its own hands that you can buy from the market board just don't ask where they can hide a little machine droid okay what if arrows and bullets have no effect on them, since, you know, the magical dragons. Maybe we need to use magic on their own, like lots of explosions. I hear you, I hear you, from the last fashion video. You wanted all a big hat for your classic job, the black mage. That's okay, I'll give you one, but you better work for this set. Since it is an alliance raid, once again my warriors of light, so you better get very lucky to get the drop against a spider lady. And once you think you are ready, I think not, since then you need to go forwards and back, and then forwards and back, with one foot forward, wait. Uh, Alexander raid nonetheless, to introduce you what is later on in the game. Just be happy that it is the default color, unless you want to dye it. Then you need to be ready for the extreme version for the raid. Better ask for a good party to rely on and then make good work of it. With the primal still working on your side, controlling them better as you are leveling up with your skills, I think it's the best way to dress up as a primal or self throughout the journey. Don't y'all agree? No worries, we don't have to kill it to roll any pieces of their armor. It just elegant tombstones of Pratic once again, with a little bit of a cheat with the hands. Centurio seals once again, and it's going to be the last time. I promise. One more roll left with three more jobs to go. After all, we have to take care of the people during the war against the dragons. Maybe a little bit of classic heals, fairy shields with dead dust, and reading the stars. Makes me wonder what for sets that we can make for them. Well, let's start out with a straightforward one. This time for the white mage, I want to go with a bit more free spirit traveler. That can also be a casual wear where you are in an ice cold place in this expansion. Nice sky pirate boots for the legs, with some nice pants that are a bit modern. Yet, the main selling point to this set, like this one, has to be the astral silk doublet of healing. It looks so comfy to wear once I saw it in the market bot, so I wanted to make a set based on that piece all alone. And I want to give my favorite sets that I've always made a nice little feather on the head, so this time it is the white mage that is the lucky one. Time to make a high fancy set for the job that likes to prove why they are the smartest in the party, by making it more fancy and more color than we just did last time. All from the simple market board once again, and boy I don't understand why people don't like this set. Maybe it's because it's hard to pick from a good legs and shoes, but that's what this video is all about. Do be careful since the color that you want to pick can be a hard choice for this main set. Then again, where this video is all about, all about those fancy sets and proving a point why you are the smartest, like the scholar over here. Even during the hardest times, you have to look up into the stars and think to yourself, why are we fighting against the dragons in the Dragon Song War? We share the same planet under the same stars, will it be dragons, warriors, of tribes? So for this last healer set and with this last job for this fashion, I wanted to go for a tribe set since they were more about nature and with the stars, Unlike us that are very busy with this during the war, what's been going on for thousands of years. So here we go! 13 wonderful fashion sets for you all to be inspired by during this time. I hope you have found something that you are willing to try out, or maybe you have found some new one that can blend well together. Going to be here for a while, because next up we are traveling all the way to the east, where we are going to furthermore to the east, to a whole new region. So get your swimming gear ready, because we are going deep under the sea, and run and choose for the open playing field with their tribes, with their traditions. 
more challenges there for you with harder than the last. With two more jobs waiting for you to discover and a limited one that was a bit late to the party. I wish you all to have a wonderful time and thank you for watching this video. I hope to see you all next time here. Bye bye everyone. Bye bye.